Howdy ho, this is Sinister here. Today I'm going to be playing a little bit of Infested Planet. And I'll log right into my existing profile now and we'll get this underway. Just going to be showing you a bit of the gameplay. Once you progress in the story mode, you're going to have various buffs that you can unlock with in game points that you earn from completing missions and uh, I believe from playing skirmishes as well you're able to unlock additional marines and you're able to purchase a shotgun like weapon upgrades you can even obtain a free medic that can heal your people or mortar which can rain down uh, grenades on the infested swarms that come at you and bunkers for that can heal nearby soldiers and the destructions that shoot as well. So I think we'll pick uh, the free medic and we'll get a mercenary. So basically, I've got two additional, two additional people for this single mission alone. So this is Crow's Neck. This is uh, a little bit into the story mode already. So I know that you guys are going to miss out. On some of the info about the storyline but this guy is like your captain and you're out to basically just clear off this infested planet and uh, make it more habitable for your own soldiers and it so your name uh, is Drake so let's read this here operation Skyhammer guess what Drake you and the doctor are going to find the source of that mysterious signal and kill it. It is coming from somewhere deep, so you will need to fight through several caves to get to it. You'll be out of radio range once you go that f once you go far enough. Get ready, you are dropping in at 700. So that's basically what that is, and um, that's just a little intel on the actual mission when you first get in. This is the doctor here. I've, uh, she's like my type of uh, commander, you might as well say. She's, uh, she's the one putting together the missions for me. So, I'll read this part here for you, since it won't be a, a tremendously long video. But Council Report seventy nine. That's not actually seventy nine missions, but. Respectfully, I disagree with the conclusion that the unidentified signal is a cave radio echo. I urge the Directorate to consider that there is more to this planet than we first anticipated. The General is sending a strike team to locate and destroy the source of the signal. Obviously, I find this course of action to be incredibly reckless. I recommend that the current mission be put on hold while the science division runs proper studies. So you've basically got the intel there, what's going on. So this is actually in game now. All these little thing, all these little areas here are actually the Zerg hubs and you can different, differentiate mine from the Zerg hubs. These are all the hubs here that you can follow my cursor. So I've got a lot of cleaning out to do. You can actually zoom in as well. And those are the Zerg turrets right there. They look like purple dildos, I know, but... You know, so we've got my hub here, which is... You can't build anything there. Those are where the bunkers will go, as I was going to talk to you about earlier. So we're going gonna to start moving now. So these are the actual minions here that you got. They, they're not always the exact same minions, but they do look sort of the same. I mean, I would... We've got... This is the first time using the medic, so she's healing up. That's your... Squadron up top there. So you got the medic rifle, 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 rifle. Down the bottom right hand corner here. You've got shortcuts for attacking, so what I'm basically doing already is doing that. Uh, you can see the red line saying, you know, follow up. Um, you also got G for like special rocket launcher 
upgrades only, so you can press G and you can see all the rockets shooting at the hub there that is producing the infested unit minions here. So thank Christ we've actually got a medic, she seems to be very good at the moment, that's if it is a she of course. So once you've actually cleared out this area here, one of the uh, many hubs that we've got to contain, they're actually called con control points but we'll just, yeah. So this comes up and BP stands for build points, so basically down the bottom left hand corner here, you've got structure for tabbing for building so at the moment I've only got six I think I can't actually see because my uh, my fraps frame rate is popped up there but yeah so you can build torrents you can also sell them for the exact amount of cost which is refund here you can sell everything for a hundred percent back obviously besides your hired marines so just talking buildings only I think what I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll sell that and I'll make another one around here so when you're actually constructing a building one of your marines has to stop and build it so you know this is the, another useful tip for any people that would like to know about the, uh, the building phase so you can get right into the action which is good you can if you need to retreat you can move back obviously the turret car that's stationary so those again are the turrets there is some pretty powerful ones like usually the purple turrets here oh, I call them dildos because they remind me of Saint Rose Free dildo but not that that's anything to be funny but oh okay that's another thing I forgot sorry if you destroy a, uh, a infested hub and you don't actually capture the control point in time they will actually respawn and yeah then you have to like deal with all of them again so we're gonna sell this now and we will make there's also shortcuts like V for the um, construction tab and all that and same for the building placement for the specific building I want to put down so we'll stop these ones from going back we'll push these guys first because I'm pretty sure he'll be able to deal with that so you can get a tactical overview of your whole map if you like but we'll continue down here first yep okay so they've got quite a lot of uh, dildos here we'll take them out with the grenade launcher rocket launcher you might as well say but that does say grenade launcher with the medic you almost feel um, you almost feel like you will never die at the moment because in the previous missions just to be honest I wouldn't I wouldn't be able to say at the top of my head but I'm gonna assume this is about mission 8 so pretty we're pretty decently into the game already for an alpha so we'll go ahead and capture this point here Alright, so we've got some more BP. Now there is a maximum of... Ouch. One guy just died there. I'm not sure exactly how. I was looking at the, uh, the building tab. Okay. So that's another thing as well as you just seen. You guys will not spawn up there where you first started. These are all control checkpoints. So basically, if you're up there and you die over here you'll respawn here as long as you have that checkpoint still under your control because the zerg or the infested or well you might as well call them zerg can uh can actually recapture those checkpoints as you've seen earlier so this is like the main hub hive look i really enjoy this game i think you guys should pick it up honestly because the gameplay is really fun i know it's not like the best looking game obviously but you gotta think of the, the quality not not so much the quality but the quantity of the the actual um gameplay experiences that you can have when playing this game i i think it's awesome 
I'm gonna kill those little grab things that are spawning. So, I was just seen earlier that the turret was facing downwards when attacking, but it's better. It, sorry, not better. It actually rotates, so it doesn't have to ver have to face one direction. It faces all directions. In case everyone, anyone was wondering about that. So I think I've got about 22 BP or 28. I can't exactly tell. I've got numbers overlapping up top there. Make another time here. These guys are dying pretty heavily. Gonna take care of those dildos. We've got another soldier to spawn down here. I think we'll uh, sell this. Oh no. That's it's gonna get overran, I think. Unless I can stop it. Oh, it might be fine. It has a few of them there. Yeah. Okay. So it should be fine. Okay. So we only got four more to complete. Only four more. Mutation regeneration. It adapts, yes. More change. I've never seen this before. What is that? It adapts, yes. More change. Hmm. Okay. So we've got spores. All hives are surrounded by proximity mines. So those are the little mines there, and now they've got regeneration. Eyes can regenerate. Eyes can heal nearby alien structures. That's another feature I forgot to announce earlier. Is that all hives will give out these special mutation adaptions, which are like there's over 70 of them in total at final product. So there's going to be a continuous refreshment of playing the game there will never just be oh the, these structures are gonna have regeneration every single time I know exactly what to do you know it's not gonna be like that it's gonna be very difficult to play and adapt your strategic approach to the aliens all the time because you will need to have that focus in trying to uh, you know just engage in the battle every single time like how I'm doing at the moment I can I can push forward because it's all not that hard for me at the moment. Like they yes they have mines on the field, but it's not all that bad. So we're gonna try to push forward up this direction while that torrent holds the left direction. So the mines can be targeted too, but I think it's just more of an nuisance thing that you've got to it's more like you can't just rush up, kill everything, you know, how I'm trying to make it seem like. So those little balls there are actually structures being made. We're trying very hard here to I think I'm going to have to build a turret here because there's too much regeneration going on here. We need the extra firepower. I'm going to make sure that I have no more soldiers out anywhere. Yeah, it should be fine. Need to move out a little bit. That's another thing is that you can't. It, it's when it when you're trying to micro your guy out of there, it's really difficult because even right clicking action means to attack. See, that's me right clicking, but you can also a click 
the, you know, for a hotkey. But if you're like stuck right next to the actual mutants here, they can be a real pain in the butt when you're trying to get away from them and your and your and your marine keeps wanting to try to fight them. So that might be something that the developers can look at trying to improve is the actual movement of your characters. Like maybe have um, a different movement so they, they're not attacking on, on demand. Okay, I need to make another one here. That rejuvenation is a bit of a pain. Okay, we'll capture this. It's a lot of mines as well. What I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna sneak this one. Mutation counterattack. Uh, to lose a point, aliens counterattack with amazing speed. So there you go. That's another mutation. I think I'm gonna get rid of that one. This one here. I think that actually might be a problem with this gun down here. As long as he's gonna get there. Well, Put an extra guy down there. We really need to get rid of this one here before it starts getting insane. Wow, these guys are really tough now. Okay, so... I don't know, that counter-attack thing... Mutation that they just adapted earlier is a bit of a pain. Or was. I don't think it's much of a pain anymore. We just need to capture this so we'll be alright. Uh, we'll build some more tyrants just for the show of it. Okay, so we've got them actually boxed in now. So this is the last control point here. And then once we've captured that, it's game over for them. And so yeah, this is basically Infestation Planet, you know, like there's plenty of there's plenty of variety in this game, like it's not just these minions, it, well it actually is just those minions for now, but they probably will introduce more minion, uh, more creature types, so, but you also gotta, you also gotta, um, remember that these mutations keep those enemies fresh, maybe not visually, but it, it keeps their attacks and their advantages fresh always in every single battle you do sure you may every now and then you might get a regeneration again but most likely not because there's so many mutations that it's almost difficult to sit there and say my minions that i was versing were always getting the same type of uh, adaptions from the mutations it's it's it, you can't just say that because I've personally had so many different ones, like I've never had these three before, and I've, I've played this game countless hours now. These torrents have a bit of a crappy range. 
I'm gonna build some more closer. You can actually shift click as well and build like that. Have multiple pop keyed up. Okay, and this is gonna be it. So thanks for watching my Infestation Planet commentary just gameplay video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and like how the game looks because that's the whole purpose of it. You know, get get your Steam wallet out guys and purchase the game because quite honestly it feels like an awesome game. Look at that, 14 minutes. So it quickly just summarizes everything that has been recorded in this map alone. So mis uh, economy, losses and kills. Bullets fired 22,199. That's almost double the amount of aliens killed. You know, so that's that's pretty that's pretty crazy. You got a lot of uh, economy, 49 out of uh, 60. What 49? But 63 was recycled. Commands issued 425. Rockets fired, etc., etc. Soldiers lost free. Usually it's uh, a ridiculous amount when you don't have a medic. That medic was really helping. Um, and also for another thing is that once you purchase that extra mercenary or medic, once they actually die, they do respawn normally. But it's again, it's only just for that. It's only just for that single mission. Anyway, guys, that's Games to Uploads video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you enjoy hearing me talk about games or doing reviews, leave a comment down in the section below. Also, also make sure to like up the video and to subscribe. I mean, it would really help me out if you guys supported me a lot more. Radio, see yous.